Ah, buenos dias. Today we're going to learn the numbers from 0 to 30 in Spanish. Learning numbers will allow you to say many things in Spanish, including telling the time. So let's begin by counting from 0, 0, to 30, 30. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Note that 16, 17, 18, and 19 are compound words. 16 is a shortened form of 10 y 6. The words for 21 to 29 are also compounds. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. The number one, uno, and numbers ending in uno, like 21, have more than one form. Before masculine nouns, uno is shortened to un. Before feminine nouns, uno changes to una. Un hombre, 21 hombres. Una mujer, 21 mujeres. Pero, atención! The forms uno and 21 are used when counting, like uno, dos, tres, or veinte, veintiuno, veintidós, and so on. They're also used when the number follows a noun, even if the noun is feminine. Right now, you are studying la lección uno. It's your turn to practice. I'll show you a number, and you say it in Spanish. Ready? Diecisiete. Ocho. Veinticuatro. Trece. Treinta. ¡Estupendo! Ready to move on? Now that you know some numbers, you'll want to ask how many people or things there are. Use cuantos before masculine nouns and cuantas before feminine nouns. To say there is or there are, use hay. Use the question form, hay, to ask is there or are there, and use no hay to say that there isn't any or there aren't any. ¿Cuántos estudiantes hay? Hay seis estudiantes en la foto. ¿Hay chicos en la fotografía? Hay tres chicas y no hay chicos. So let's recap. You've learned the numbers from 0 to 30. You've also learned how to ask how many and how to answer by saying there is or there are a certain number. Hay una llama! What's it doing off its leash? Te toca a ti! Here's one last check to make sure you understand. 